Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Best be on my way. Apparently there's another letter from Orin, so I checked out. You have done well, Underling. Baldur's Gate gags on Gortash's goal, and your little pet still has a eyes to witness it. Now, to do proper honor to the murder lord, you must submit yourself to the trial in the murder tribunal. Remember, Sicarius. Succeed there, and you may find me in Bull's temple. Deep below the tyrant's rotted cobbles, in that unholy sanctum, the murder lord will watch our blood duel at last. I will keep your minion safe until then, unless it misbehaves. Orin. Great. Glad to have an ally. We catch a faint odor, one without any discernible source. Wet ash, dried mud, and a hint of sulfur. Mizora channeled the hell's essence into you. You'll never be rid of their scent. I hope. I pray that you'll show more care in the future. Okay. I'll try, I guess. I'm still thinking about Karlak. About what she said. Cut. There really is no justice in the world. Hmm. Oh, that's Halsey, right? Poor Karlak. Having to face her own mortality in such a definitive manner. Though the rest of us are still liable to perish, if it's any consolation. Hmm. Yeah. Whatever happens next. Okay. No sense dawdling. Karlak has precious little time left to her. We'd do better than to waste it. Karlak has had her mortality defined to her in most cruel terms. I do not know if we can help her, but... Perhaps we can at least be there for her. Well, I definitely won't be giving her any more soul coins. Wait, just maybe you can do something about it. Fate, dost thou require a new ally? Nope. Okay, but this time, uh, it will be interesting because I want to try. Just to look upon you. Uh, stay in wherever the camp. you need me. I'll be right. And I'm gonna go paper team. What do you need? With Blackhead is relentless. Stop you talking about that. Well, let us hope she exhausts her force. He always tells the that one of her I years oh. swatting away my fears and doubts of my infernal fate. And I eventually made my peace. I had to. You will too, Karlak. I know it. That's the spirit. The Emperor always talks this sentence about Vakif each time I try speaking to Will or getting him into my party. It's repetitive. Didn't create on that. Counter spell, maybe? Or foil, fireball. Fireball. I forgot to replace a spell. <laughs> Let's try banishment. Uh, Let's try slow. Oh, you have flame strike. Okay, you have those high level spells. Uh, let's see which bolt for. Wall of fire. 
Although it was, it will be first level spell, to fourth level spell. Scorching ray. Let's give him another hand trip. They're bold. Yeah. Do you have... you don't have... oh, we don't have gloves or boots. Hey. Hey, hey. Carla has all them. Oh, I have some. Oh. I mean, he can always cast fear. I have some shoes. Hmm. Light on one shields. This is a dagger. Hmm. You this is a rapier, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> By the way, uh, are you proficient in those weapons? No. Great. Elminster's not around. Yes, for no one is well. proficient with those. Uh, Where am I needed? Quarter stuff, yeah, sure. Uh, Let's give him that. Magic. A thunder of smite. I mean, here will be illuminating shot and dazzling ray. I think we can try that. Does he gain it? Yeah. I think we can risk that. I don't. Oh! Haha! Teleport to an area and deal 2 to 6 in fire damage. Okay. And some amulet. Can't give up now. I swear, give me enough time and I'll find everything I need across people from our party. <laughs> what the hell? I cannot sort his equipment. Great. Um. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Okay, I don't think we sh we should. We need to camp just yet. Instead, let's go to the basilisk gate. Yes. We looted Kortash's body. I still haven't found the way to. Ah, actually, we can go back. To the worms crossing, back to the prison. Now we have Will. Maybe he will tell me what to do with that strange wall. Hmm. Hmm. That sounds like an idea. So I'll get there and I'll be right back. Hey! Reciprocation! Watchers, ignore you. Foundry. Neutralized. Witnesses, eliminated. You walk free. You won. Task. Kill Orin! Kill Orin! 
Kill Orin! Kill Orin! I don't get me wrong, I wanted to kill her anyway. But apparently before we do that. Please no. Maybe we should finally before we kill Orin maybe we should pay a visit to Wait, what was his name? Kazodan, Karazan, Kasador, no <laughs> You know the vampire Kasador Kazador I would be a, a, a horrible adventurer. I would have to write notes on everyone's names. And then when we, when I finally would meet someone, uh, what? Well, sorry, was your name Corazal? No. Nothing. I don't wanna use not like bolting. I applaud your taste. Not that. Ooh. It worked differently. Ooh, 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 ooh. ooh. Too big. Too big, you say. Uh, come on, do your thing. Where the hell are we? Oh. Apparently, gas form has pockets. Don't ask why. It just no does. Despite everything. Nice. Oh, we are in danger. How much farther can I go? That's a mimic, right? Or not. Why would I need portion of invisibility? Why do I have a feeling that I'm gonna screw around and find out the bad way what's gonna happen. Thank you. That wasn't me. Here we go. Baldurin and his winged ally admiring the fruits of their labor. The city itself. Is that Baldurin with a bronze dragon? Must have been quite an adventure. Baldurin sails away and leaves the dragon to watch over his city. Do the histories make mention of this? The worm's lair. Incredible. The legends were true, and we've marked our place among them. We'll prove our worth with untrusted swords and meet the dragon. The good dragon. Or so we pray. Gods bless our endeavor. 
I don't remember which dragons were evil. The statue before you bears a familiar likeness. It is Balduran, the celebrated adventurer who founded the city of Baldur's Gate. Peril floods my province. The Palisades fall, the earth does tremble. The servants of shadow and blood assemble. Beyond lies the Grand Worm, deep in slumber, awaiting a true hero's advent, should my domain drown in torment. Be you the deluge, turn away. Be you the hero, answer true. Are you worthy? Poetic nonsense. There is no one and no savior. Examine the statue. You sense neither life nor spirit within the statue. A powerful variant of magic mouth has been cast on it, allowing it to speak only recorded messages. What are you? What is this place? The statue gives no response. I am Morphy. Open the way. Ancient Ansor, hear me. A champion is proclaimed. The test begins. Let your judgment follow. I don't want to be tested. Thank you for saving again. By the way. And I never knew this was under them. Hmm. What other wonders have I missed? Oh, we have animated, but not the other one. Oh, wrong thing. Wait a moment. Train lightning, maybe instead of this. Wait. All right. Disintegrate. Disintegrate. Conjure elemental instead of old person. Image contra minor elemental. I think it will be fine. Which we can use as a vehicle. Okay, you. I've got a long road ahead. I'm probably gonna regret that if there's at any point a section in which we will have to be sneaky. So we shall go together. Hmm. I'll give it a shot. Chamber of Courage. Okay, so first things first, let's get ourselves scratch. Let's do the dance macabre. What do you mean not enough space? Of course it's enough space. Um what else can we do? Sharp as ever. I guess I will need you as well. Can you summon anything? Yes, you can. Close it. Let me... Let me close it. I like closets. <laughs> um... For turn this. Okay, so you are the one that's gonna pick it up and you're gonna cast the shield on yourself. Champion burns bright. Even when rushing waters 
and moaning winds threaten to extinguish the flames. Take the torch. Withstand the elements. Prove your courage. And if I don't want to? Okay, take the torch. Of course it's not first. It's nothing... Wait, can I... Throw you guys off? Nice. Now, if you will be so kind, I have four turns, which makes this perfect. Can I do this again? I can surely try. Nice. <laughs> well, I got rid of half of my of our enemies. <laughs> Actually, I want you to hasten yourself. That will give you additional action. Nice. Was it? Can you get there? Well, you surely can go invisible. carry on no I have two weapons so I don't wanna create another one for myself Okay, uh, please go over there so we are safe. Half damage of all, all damage, okay. We didn't see anything fire related so far. Doesn't mean there won't be anything fire related, it just. Two steps at a time. Okay. Can you? You can, great. Can you? Yes, you can. Split the damage. Hmm? Oh, hi, guys. You probably won't go to sleep. the same or something similar with him not flourish um, just attack him and please don't yeah. and don't slip <laughs> nice Lightning on those two guys. Anyone is healing? No. Can do this thing and no. And actions. 
fireball. I'll train the <gasps> I mean, why not? He's still alive. Okay, you get over here. He's still alive. Thank you. Oh no, my cool lightning. I mean, why not? If it works. Pass it on you. That was a lot of messes, and I appreciate that. Come on. Oh, that's enough. And the other one. Oh, he's over here. I don't mean that your path is interrupted. I don't understand why my turn was terminated. more subjective to lightning damage. Oh, there's another one here. I forget about him. Sure. Okay, this one is dead. This one is almost dead. I did not expect it to have this outcome, but it worked. Get them into the Okay, you can stay here. Oh, that's cool. Hi. Okay. Do I get some bonuses if I kill him before the gun runs out?
if we can make it over here, then I'm gonna hit him. There's no more enemies, so... It's a beacon to me and light you like. May you ever withstand the raging elements. Proceed. champion knows justice and eliminates those who stand in its way. Restore the balance of justice. Justice. No pardon without repentance and no penalty without mercy. The right path often lies between the extremes. Mercy. Police. Justice should be a harsh lesson. All the better to deter the next vagabond. Is that a general aphorism of yours, or are you trying to be helpful? Both. Relevant words for times of strife, and for a dragon's underground trial. If we're lucky. If we're lucky. The apple. The painting depicts a red-haired man stealing a shiny apple from a cart in an open-air market. You know this market, the Wide, where Baldur's Gate citizens and visitors gather to conduct trade and wax political. Here goes nothing. The Child. A red-haired man is portrayed with his cloak's hood lowered, giving an apple to a smiling urchin. Several other children are huddled behind the one receiving the apple. Hands outstretched. The induction. A red-haired man is depicted in hushed conversation with a dark-haired woman. She wears a cloak with an unusual symbol on it. Tally marks totaling the number nine. Number nine. Um... What is that? Uh, see invisibility. No, I have one. I'm wondering what that is. Wait, can we jump up there? Nope. There's also some symbols here. The theft. A red-haired man is depicted in the Hall of Wonders, thieving what looks to be a priceless artifact. It's an astrolabe of entrapment. It could hold a dozen gin within it, perhaps even more. Hmm. Wait, can we snuff out those guns? Or can you do a Okay, so that's not how it works here. Mm -mm. All right, what now? The chase. A red-haired man is depicted running through the city streets, a flaming fist officer chasing just behind. A cloaked woman, hair dark as a raven, 
looks on from a safe distance. Let's see what this does. And the last one. The judgment. A stern judge, his pockets full of coin, orders a red-haired man to the gallows. A shiny apple rests on the ground nearby. Hmm. What path lies before me? What's up for discussion? Away! Behold, the paintings tell the tale. My judgment is rendered. The thief earns his due. Okay. Oh, there's something here. I had unexpected puzzles. Is the Great Worm really hidden behind tests of this kind? I would expect it feats of strength, yes, but nothing like this. Like it was designed for sport. Shadows are blocking me. I need to get rid of them somehow. Um with light? Light of day, maybe? The shadows are blocking me. I need to get rid of them somehow. Any one of you know how to cast light? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> oh my goodness. How delicious. And you didn't take this. The people. No. Where's your weapon? With quarter stuff. Okay, let's go grab Shadow Heart. So she can cast the light of day. Or remove curse, maybe? Still alive, so that's progress. Hi, what are you doing here? But please don't look at me. Okay, where's your the Girl, okay, never mind. Oh, Carlock. I need a moment for the two of us. How are you? Hey, soldier, you're back. So no. Still soldier after everything we've been through, huh? Old habits. Did I miss anything while I was off having a sulk? Oh, we can talk about that later. I'm more concerned about you. Would you believe it if I said I'm all right? You know, soldier, we're so fucked. The Dark Three are trying to consume the Sword Coast. We've still got tadpoles in our eyes, and I've got a ticking time bomb in my chest. I'm not sure anyone has ever been more fucked than this. And yet, we're fine. In this moment, we're fine. Here I am, there you are, breathing, talking. Even laughing if we want. Is it very precious to say that despite it all, I'm happy? If you're happy, I'm happy. In that case, there's something I wanted to ask you. Will you stay with me when it's time for me to go? I think I can do anything if you're there. Even die. Of course, I'll be there. Whatever you want. Thank you. Now, enough tragedy. I'm not gone yet. And our schedule is packed with important heroics, isn't it? Plus, if I cry any more, I'm going to run out of tears and start leaking motor oil. Thanks for everything, soldier. I'm extremely glad to be in this thing together. I still wish you would go to Hope. Well, you're saying here. For now. This place is astonishing. A bard's legend made real. Are you sure? 
for now yes i need shadow heart for that if we really need there she's almost pleasant mm, traveling with company sure. if you uh, ignore all that need... all right blackhead is relentless each time i take shadow heart into my team i think anyone into my team he keeps talking about the black Eve. Now search the room. There's a statue that conceals the way through. I'll reveal it to you. Okay. The more stupid thing first. This the dishonorable judge was banished. The judgment But the judgment must still be passed. Move. The hanging. A red haired man is depicted hanging from a gallows as a crowd looks on. You notice a child in the crowd, a falling tear leaving a trail on his cheek. Freedom. A red haired man walks the streets of Baldur's Gate, clad in a billowing cloak. You catch a glimpse of a sly smile beneath his hood. And a golden coin in his hand. Seems simple enough. The cell. A stern prison guard slides a warm meal into the thief's cell. The red haired man has a ten day left to serve, judging by the scratchings on the wall behind him. The cell, I think it will be suitable for him to serve it. Can anyone with bigger strength please place the painting here? We banished the dishonorable judge and applied Lex Talionis, the principle of the sentence being proportional to the crime. You are a paragon of justice. Proceed. Thank you. Okay, I can close the log. Okay, as usually, let's save before wandering anywhere else. I've started doing more saves because I don't want the game to crash again. Or so fuck. A good leader has the insight to find good counsel. As a war reaches its end, there is one who doesn't advise for the city's prosperity. Find him and strike him down. Okay, and... Hmm? Boop. Blank. Hold still, will you? Do I have silence? Wait, can I catch... You can put them to sleep. Okay. I see one here. There's the second one and the third one. Okay. Okay, I hit it. Okay. Can you move a little bit? Ah, oh, get over here. Stand perfectly here. Okay, I hit this one. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Where I see it. Okay. <laughs> the virtues of unions by Alwyn Stead. It is quite obvious that larger kingdoms offer benefits to all peoples within. As the kingdom grows, so does its fields, its populace, and its economy. A few charred corpses is a worthy sacrifice, if a dragon offers to share his hoard, after all. So too should you seek union, however imperfect, should a powerful kingdom march its army on your borders. Some friction is inevitable, of course, 
citizens' rights might erode, for instance, but such lesser issues will be sanded down by the march of time. Such is the price of peace. And that was by Steads. By Stead. Okay. The Ethic of War by Christina Suelto. My colleague Am 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 Amaps proposes fair rules of engagement in times of war and forgiveness upon victory. Are we to spare our enemies then, once they have fallen to our might? Are we to put all hatred behind us when surrender is offered? Indeed not. For what shall we do once our opponent gathers new armies and masses them once again along our borders? We shall wage another war and count the lives snuffed out by our own mag magnanimity. Once an enemy kingdom is conquered, it must be raised to the ground. Only then can we be free of its specter. Oh, Christina, I don't think you are in the right. A five-year war by Torin Bass. The war was, in truth, nothing short of a tragedy. It began as a mild altercation between the sanguine sons of the Aelio and Vida families regarding if you can believe it, the proper ownership of sheep farm. Over the course of three seasons, full-blown conflict had erupted between Baldur's Gate and Victan, a pointless war leaving both cities with nothing but a thousand youthful corpses to show for it. I'm so glad that he has so many spell slots to use that. My life has been a long succession of pleasures. To see my town take my ideas and cease legal discrimination of local orgs. To see my fights against horrid living conditions in city factories take off. To have the chance to see a new generation take to these ideas of better, kinder, fairer, intelligent world and run with it to the to new reaches of the continent. It was not a life of a struggle, however, and I shall regret its failures. My old friend Suelto comes to mind, who adopted such cruel ideologies later in life. I will forever console myself in the idea that such a brilliant mind would only conceive such fears under the strain of exile and the promise of reinstatement as she ultimately was. This text roots its subject on Baldurran, a sailor of exquisite renown who founded the city of Baldur's Gate many years ago. The prose is colorful, but a little too self-satisfied around the ages, edges, and the novel sh would be unremarkable but for one small entry about halfway through. Balduran claimed a guardian and friend, Ansu, bright were Ansu's scales and brighter still his breath. Yet after a betrayal too piercing to recount here in movie detail, Ansu fled beneath the stone thereby changing the name of the region he now slumbers under too much his draconic lineage. I think we'll go... Uh, I think it was Suelto? The second one that we read? Suelto, yeah. I do believe it's her. Kill one, strike the one that's in wrong. An insightful decision, the free of peace bore lasting fruit. Proceed. Okay, thank you. Oh, we lost one gold somewhere. What a shame. Okay, there's one more over here. Looking ahead. Yeah. Of our misadventures to date. You think so? Ah! That wasn't enough. Cast another fireball. Prove 
of your strategic wits. I have none. There's but one rule. The Dark King must fall in two moves. Are you a commander of armies? Or a shivering pawn? Fodder for cleverer minds. The second one. I like playing chess, but I suck miserable. Miserably. Vedor and Amglir are gone. A hot breeze is evident. Elementals took by us by surprise. There are so few of us. Oh no. Um, queen. Okay. Rook. King. I mean, if the queen goes here. He must fall into moves, which means it will be a failure. Again. It would be a lot easier if I knew how he, how she can move. Wait. If I move this here. Why? Chance be your last. Can anyone help me with that? Why was that a failure straight away? Oh, because you can... Okay, no. No. If I move the, this rook over here, the king can take it, but then the queen can take the king. Mind helping? Whatever ancient purpose is imbued in these halls, it may not welcome our presence here. We should be wary of whatever lurks beneath the dust. Hmm. Well, all oh, right. Maybe we can take Will with us here. Okay, Shadowheart. Thank you for helping. Well, I hope. Aside from the obvious. Oh, stay sure. here. Stay. Fine. Let's talk. Join me. That's the Great. Now let's go back. You know what? <laughs> Screw you, you're cheating, so I'm also gonna cheat. Just the king, right? The black, ki black king has fallen. May you always crush the wicked by the poor knight or monarch. I'm fairly sure that my second try would prove fruitful, but since they decided it's not, it's basically I felt encouraged to cheat. So there's that. <sighs> Why is there? Oh, okay. It does not. I think it does not. With courage does the hero march, fettered by the taxing chains of fear. A stalwart soul must ever persevere. With insight does the hero choose. Guidance born of ancient wisdom proven. Peace, not strife, the undenied conclusion. With justice does the hero rule. Lead not the guiltless lamb to bloody slaughter. No, cleanse the lion's sins in sacred water. With strategy does the hero scheme. A cunning mind, a hundred steps ahead, your allies close, 
your rivals stunned in dread. Worthy you are found. Go forth, hero. Seize your fate. And rise, great worm, heart of the gate. Okay, but before I do that, I need to rest. <laughs> yes, please. I don't have enough time to rest. Oh. Alrighty. Um, and I still didn't buy myself a pajama. Thought this place was just a legend. <laughs> Tall tales just keep coming true. Hmm. We get along quite well. And you guys? Nizora, can you please go out from my camp now? We're done. Please. <laughs> Let's talk. Okay, apparently no. Uh, you. The Absolute's voice is gone, but I still hear its echoes. Reflections of reflections. What brings you by? I want you out of here. No, no. I'm afraid that's not an option. I'm quite stubborn, you see. Take a swing or a stab if you want, but I'll just slip away for a breather. One of the perks of being a half devil, of course. You're just a half devil? Oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Hello, my dear. Okay. I wasn't expecting it, but I'm glad to have some company on this journey. Volo, maybe you have something to talk about this for these rooms? Next, be sure that I will Nothing, okay. Gail. What do you need? Where's your pajamas? Why are your eyes what? A curious discovery, this place. This city builds and builds upon itself until it forgets its own secrets. Hmm. Where's my bed? I really don't where's my bed. Oh, here's my bed. So much. That's that's kind of nice. Uh, I need something with four instead. Or I can do this and take this instead. Soldier. There's blood at my bed. Scratch. Where's okay, the owlbear is still alive. Whew. The dog is unable to speak through the small bag he holds in his mouth. Did you got there? I don't know. Maybe you can tell me. All I know is I thought of you when I saw it. <laughs> Thank you. It's 
So. <laughs> ah, I'm glad you have enough food. Okay, but I think this is gonna. I'm gonna end spot here. Very delicious, but I will not bite you. So that is gonna be it for today. Thank you very much, Stellite, and see you soon. Bye.